So we at the NHL, our research focuses, as I said, on bone marrow failure syndromes. And over the past eight years, we found that our trombo pack um, be very efficient efficient in the treatment of uh, patients with various conditions of bone marrow failure syndrome. Um, Altromopac is a mimetic of an endogenous blood growth factor called thrombopoietin. And thrombopoietin is important uh, for platelet production, but it's also important for maintaining stem cells. And uh, it was initially FDA approved for the treatment of a condition called ITP. This is where the body destroys their own platelets. Um, but thrombopoietin also works on stem cells, on all kinds of hematopoietic stem cells. And that's why we tested this in the setting of bone marrow failure syndromes. Um, and the patient I presented here as a case report right now um, is a long standing patient with Dam and Blackfin anemia. And um, she uh, developed what we call pancytopenia, which is not um, what usually the diamond blackfin anemia present with initially. They only um, have a reduction in their red cells, but she also over the years had a reduction in all her blood cell lineages. And um, she failed steroid therapy, she failed other experimental therapies, so we decided to try Altrombopac. Um, in her because it also works on other bone marrow failure syndromes and um, luckily it worked. Uh, she recovered her blood uh, cell counts, all her blood cell counts, she's now transfusion independent um, and we stopped the drug and interestingly when we stopped the drug her blood counts declined again which makes us believe that Altromopec is um, really specifically acting on um, her stem cells to produce red cells. We restarted our trauma pack and we now have her on a lower dose um, and her blood counts remain stable and she's transfusion independent. As I said, I mean, this is all investigational um, and we don't want to recommend using our trauma pack in DBA patients outside of clinical studies. That's very, very important. Um, but as of now, she remains stable on a lower dose of the drug and um, Given the nature of the disease, uh, being an inherited disease, it is likely that she may have to continue uh, Altrombopac long term or that she needs intermittent treatment of Altrombopac. But this is what we don't know right now, we're trying to investigate. Um, and ideally, uh, with um, enrolling more patients in that clinical study so we can learn more about the disease and also the mechanism how Altrombopac works in this disease, but also to um, get more information um, about the treatment timeline and um, dosage of the drug.